Despite the provisional count pointing to the re-election of President Toadera, his party says they'll wait for the final results due on January 19th to make an announcement. The opposition says the election was flawed and undermined by attacks by armed groups. Anissa Georges Dologele, who came second with 21% of the vote, does not recognize Toadera's win and is preparing an appeal to the Constitutional Court. We will have requests which show that certain figures are false. And we have a general request showing that these elections are not organized under conditions which make them credible and acceptable. So it will be up to the Constitutional Court to take the decisions, depending on the seriousness of the facts, that we will make available to them. According to the National Election Authority, of 1.8 million registered voters, fewer than 700,000 could cast their ballot. They say that many were destroyed and that several hundred stations closed because of the threat of armed militia. Beyond Bangui, things are still tense. The rebel coalition of Patriots for Change still claims to hold the town of Bangassou since clashes there on Sunday. Its troops continue to advance throughout the country and clash with national forces and allies.